Princess Kate made headlines when she issued a heartfelt statement in her own words which some say broke royal protocol according to a royal biographer the message was a rare departure from the traditional way of doing things in the royal family the Princess of Wales had just completed her chemotherapy treatment and announced the news in an emotional video posted on her and Prince William's official social media accounts the message was deeply personal and it marked a significant moment as it came six months after she first revealed her cancer diagnosis. In his latest book on King Charles titled New King New Court Royal biographer Robert Hardman discussed how Princess Kate's statement broke with royal protocol normally such announcements would be issued in a very formal manner but Kate's message stood out Robert explained that the statement was attributed not to HRH the Princess of Wales but simply to Catherine the Princess of Wales which may seem like a minor detail but in the world of royal traditions it was a significant departure from the usual formalities. The video itself which was shared widely across social media wasn't just a casual family production either according to Robert the video was filmed by a professional cameraman from BBC Studios Events Productions the same team responsible for filming major royal events like the coronation and the funeral of Queen Elizabeth II however despite the professional production the words spoken in the video were entirely Kate's own which was another break from royal tradition this added a deeply personal touch to the message that resonated with many. In addition to the personalized nature of the message the transcript of Kate's statement released by Buckingham Palace also broke with standard protocol normally these types of statements follow a more rigid structure but Kate's words reflected her own feelings and experiences making it clear that this was a special moment for her and her family this move was seen as a reflection of how the royal family is modernizing and becoming more relatable to the public. Despite the emotional nature of her announcement Princess Kate has not yet fully returned to her royal duties however Buckingham Palace has confirmed that she will be stepping back into the public eye for two significant events this weekend Kate will join other members of the royal family in London to honour veterans as part of the Remembrance Sunday commemorations which are an important annual tradition for the royal family and the country. According to a statement from Buckingham Palace Princess Kate will attend the Royal British Legion Festival of Remembrance at the Royal Albert Hall this weekend this event is a key part of the Remembrance Day activities where the royal family pays tribute to those who have served in the armed forces the event will be attended by King Charles the Prince and Princess of Wales the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh the Princess Royal and other senior members of the royal family. The statement also revealed that this will be one of the first major royal events Kate will attend since completing her chemotherapy treatment it marks an important step in her gradual return to public life and royal duties her presence at these events will no doubt be meaningful for both her family and the public as they continue to show their support for her during this challenging time. In addition to the Remembrance Festival Kate will also be joining her family for the Remembrance Sunday service at the Senate half which is another significant event during the Remembrance Day weekend this solemn service honors the sacrifices of those who have served in the armed forces and is one of the most important events on the royal calendar Kate's participation in these events shows her dedication to her royal duties even as she continues to recover from her illness. King Charles and other senior royals will also attend the Remembrance Sunday service alongside Princess Kate including the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh the Princess Royal and Vice Admiral Sir Tim Lawrence the Duke and Duchess of Gloucester and the Duke of Kent this weekend will be an important one for the royal family as they come together to honour veterans and reflect on the sacrifices made.